Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see how to add and register an application using the app registrations experience in the Azure portal. So what happens is like uh, the developers and uh, SaaS providers can develop commercial cloud services or the LOB applications that can be integrated with Microsoft Identity Platform to provide secure sign-in and authorization for their services. This, this video will show you how to add and register an application using the app registration in the Azure portal so that your app can be integrated with the Microsoft Identity Platform. So let me just quickly log on to the portal and take it from there. All right, I'm logged on to the portal and uh, again, I'm going to go to the Azure Active Directory. And under the services, I'm going to select app registrations here. And as soon as it comes up, I'm going to do the new registration by clicking on here. So when this, uh, register an application page would appear we will enter the details like uh, the app we would do test Azure app and it says supported account types i'm going to select account in this organization directory only so when i select the account in this organizational directory only I'm selecting this option because uh, if I'm building a line of business application, this option is not available if we are not registering the application in directory. This option maps to Azure AD only single tenant. This is the default option unless uh, we are registering the app outside of a directory. In cases where the app is registered outside of a directory, the default is Azure AD multi tenant here. So if you would select as your account in any organizational directory, uh, so this app uh, register the app as Azure AD only single tenant. We can we can also update it to be Azure AD multi tenant and back to single tenant through the authentication bed after we have done it. So when we'll do it, I'm going to select the redirect UI as uh, the HTTP. Backpack. And I'm going to change the app name as well just for the sake of this lab to Contoso app. And I'm going to change, sorry about it, I'm going to change this uh, option, the URL, redirect URI as well. So I'm going to do it HTTPS colon slash slash app dot contoso dot com. And for this a web application as well. So I'm going to click on a register. Here. So it is creating the application, it's registering this app inside the Azure AD. So it comes up with this. So Azure AD would assign a unique application uh, ID to the app, which says the application or the client ID, you see this, right? To add additional uh, capabilities to the application, we can select other configuration options, including the branding, certificates, secrets, API permissions, and more from this manage options. And this is how you uh, register an application inside the Azure AD using the portal. I hope this was informative to all of you guys. If you have any queries, please mention them in the comment section and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Have a good day.